Welcome to IBC 2022. It's been three long years since the world's most inspiring content and technology event occurred in Amsterdam. And Broadcast is here in Europe to engage with each other, unlock business opportunities, discover the latest innovations, and explore the exciting world of content. Ashley within Broadcast, joining me is Susanna of Cobalt Digital. Hi, good to see you. Nice to see you. Yeah, nice it's to great see you. to see you after a couple of years now. But yes. uh, So can you tell me about Cobalt's position in the media and broadcasting industry and how the company is preparing for the future right now? Uh, sure. Well, we, we always have, uh, we always try to focus on the latest and greatest. Uh, we obviously uh, see continue to see 4K as a direction, 2110. Uh, we, we've been... Um, very strong in the HDR, SDR to HDR uh, technology. We, we think this is really um, a, a very important uh, adoption for many broadcasters now, very popular. And we are big uh, proponents of RISC, the Reliable Internet Stream Transport Protocol. So it's very close and dear to Cobalt's heart. We're very involved. I'm the chair of the, the RISC forum. Our CTO is the president of the forum. So we're very involved with, you know, a little bit of throughout all different technologies, so. And what trends are you noticing right now in terms of technology in the media and broadcasting industry? Well, with um, one that we're noticing is on, uh, on the risk side, there's a lot of adoption. We started, uh, the risk concept was born really five years ago, and now there's 215 companies uh, actively involved. Uh, Cobot is very, very involved. We, we have support in our compression gear, encoders, decoders, also our SafeLink. One thing we're highlighting at the show is the SafeLink gateway. Uh, it, it really, SafeLink adds protection to live audio and video data over unsecure networks uh, for legacy devices. So um, we, we offer the SafeLink um, option. It, it, it's based on the RISC protocol. It supports UDP, RTP, FEC, and RISC. And um, the RISC protocol adds the main profile, uh, which adds uh, encryption and authentication um, to the link. So it's a very secure way of sending um, anything over the internet. So that's our safe link. It comes in two formats. We, we are launching the software only version. You can run into any computer. And also you can run into the Open Gear PC card that we have. That's also very unique. in the Open Gear um, family of products uh, worldwide, we are the only company that offer PC in the open gear format, so you can also buy SafeLink uh, based on that. So that's one thing. Another trend that we are, we are very tight, tightly with is uh, 2110. So we we launched um, Indigo is our 2110 umbrella of products, and now we have this Dota card, which is a highly integrated um, option to our existing 9904 UDX 4K card, and also to our 9905 MultiPath. Uh, processing cards. So now you can have uh, IPs in and out, SGI to IP, IP to SGI, not only on our highly dense uh, 9905 card, which is a quad path, or you can also have with native 4K processing on the 9904 card. So that's one big thing that we're proposing here. And um, another big thing for the show is our super high density uh, Dante. You know, we, we announced the 3G SDI. A bridge to Dante Audio. So we have the 9904 card that it also is extremely powerful in, on the audio side video, but also audio. It does 16 in, D embed channels on each of the four inputs. It, it supports 64 MADI uh, discrete AES channels. And now on top of all the capabilities of audio, we're adding this Dante license. So the Dante adds another 128 channels of Dante per card. So once you populate the TRQ, open your frame, you really have extreme density and um, you're able to you know, have mixing and routing of audio channels between inputs and outputs. It's this really highly capable platform. It's very unique um, in the industry, so we're pleased with that. Many things you're showcasing. That was actually going to be my question was what you were showcasing or any new developments. I think you probably just named most of them. Yes. But did I miss anything that's new currently here? No, we're always featuring the latest on HDR, SL HDR, of course. We do support all encoding and decoding. And uh, those are some of the, the highlights for the show. Very good. And so with what are the growth and changes that have happened right now with the company? 
We actually were very fortunate in the last couple of years with COVID, we experienced ex extreme growth worldwide. We just recently added a, a sales director in Asia Pacific, a uh, very well known, respected uh, person, Anthony Tan. We also just announced promotion of our executive vice president of engineering at the CTO, who is very well known in the industry. We also hired recently a sales director in EMEA for uh, Europe, Middle East, and Africa. So we're growing in all fronts. We have a number of new resellers, system integrators, uh, sales have grown, and uh, also our engineering group has grown. So overall, it's been fabulous uh, three COVID years for Cobalt. And uh, we're looking forward to meeting with everybody again and being live and uh, uh, getting to shake hands again and hugs and um, being together in the industry, yes. Yes, and that's great to hear. Uh, it's always a pleasure being over here at Cobalt. Thank you, Susanna. It was great talking Thank to you. Thank you, Ashley.